now. Nothing region. Nah. I, I wouldn't go into a distant relationship. I wouldn't go into a distant relationship. Is it because you have trust issues or what? Yeah, I do. I have. I have mm. trust. Yeah, I really And do. are you an overthinker? I I think yes, right? yeah, mm. I do. Yeah, I do. <laughs> okay. I think overthinking ruins relationship. Or well, what do you think? It does, but sometimes, sometimes I think we the things we think about, they are right. They are right. Yeah. Oh, okay. Hello, lovely people. Welcome back to Street Vibes on Daily News Hype. We are all aware that we've been blank for some time, but nothing's paused. Yes. So today we are here with another content very interesting yes so today i'm going to ask people what they really think about distance relationships and then if they are interested to be in one yes yeah, so let me go out there and then ask people their views on this particular question thank you so much enjoy the contents bye young lady i'm susan and you hi i'm angelique Angelique. Angelique. Oh, okay. I like your name. You're very pretty too. Okay. I like your necklace as well. Thank you. <laughs> okay, so Angelique, I would like to ask you a very simple question. Yes. Okay, so the question is, would you like to be in a distance relationship? Yeah, for me, it's not a problem. Oh, wow. Yes. It's not a problem. Yes. But before that, are you single? No, I'm not. You're not single? Oh, okay. I think you've spoken the truth. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. So, Ojoli, right? Ojoli. Oh, Ojoli. Okay. You are live on Daily News. I please say hi to our viewers. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Okay. So, why would you want to be in a distance relationship? For me, I did it before. So, for me, I don't think I don't see any inconvenience in it. Uh, okay. But before that, what do you um consider to be a uh, um? A distance relationship or what do you consider as a distance relationship like like how do you understand distance relationship different countries every time with video calls and yeah okay so that's your understanding on distance relationship oh i see i see okay do you consider it interesting yes very interesting yes you won't see the person you won't get to it's better it's better if the person is here with you but if the if we have no choice then i'll take it like that so can it lead to marriage hey <laughs> no <laughs> no okay so as even you are dating a guy who is far away from you and then you are just dating him without it with the intention of you not getting married to him how is that going to work? oh no if there's no intention of marriage i don't think that will work but then what if there is an intention for marriage? Yeah, it can work. It can work. Oh, okay. Aisha. Yes. Aisha is going to be interested, like very interesting as you say. Yes, yeah, some works. Oh, okay. Okay, so, please your name again. Angelique. Angelique. Hey, sorry, forgive me, okay? Angelique. Angelique, you're a very nice girl. Okay. Your dress, everything is on point. Just give them a 360 so that they will see everything well. Like, I mean everything. Yeah, see fine girl. Oh, okay, so please, I would like you to leave your social media handle. It could be Instagram, Snapchat. People to out there to, you know, get in touch with you. Because for all you know, people want to, you know, text you and everything, yeah. Okay, I will do that. Um, my Instagram is k. Angelique with double U. Okay, okay. What's up, Snap? Or just IG? Yeah, just IG. Oh, okay, so my guys out there, as you can see, Angelique has dropped her IG handle. Yes, you can go and then text her every time. No. Yeah, and then <laughs> no, please don't text me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, she said, no, you can you can text her. Don't worry. We'll talk behind the scenes. You can text her, okay? Yeah, please. Thank you so much for your time. I appreciate it. I'm Ernest. Ernest. Okay, Ernest, please, you're live on Daily News Hype. Please say hi to our viewers. Hi. Okay. Okay, Ernest, so I'm here to ask a very simple question. Okay. The question is, will you want to be in a distance relationship? Mm, no. No. Okay, before that, are you single? Yes, please. Are you sure? Yeah. Very sure. Yes. Okay. Okay, so what do you consider as a distance relationship? Okay. So let's say if I'm at Kaswa and then I'm in a relationship and the lady is at Accra, let's say Accra. Yeah, so maybe 
we normally chat and then call ourselves. We don't we don't normally see each other like that. Yeah, that's what I would say is a distance relationship. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So you wouldn't like to be in one, right? Why? Um, I want to be in touch with my lady. Like I'll see her face to face. Yeah. <laughs> Just see her face to face. So there's more to it. Yeah, more to it. Like going out with her. Yeah. Just that. I sure. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. So you consider a distance relationship to be a bad one, right? Yeah, sure. Okay, so since you are saying you are single, many girls out there will want to, you know, like be friends with you and all that, but then they wouldn't know how to get in touch with you. Yeah, so if you have any social media handle, you can just leave it so when they want to text you, wow. Okay. It could be Instagram, it could be Snap, WhatsApp number, anything, yeah. Okay, I'm on WhatsApp and Facebook and then Snap. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so give us one. Or you can give us the three or oh, okay, so let me give you my WhatsApp line. Zero five five seven two four four five one nine. Okay, so my girls you had a number. <laughs> yes, and it's right on the screen. Yes, yeah, so make sure you text him. I hope when they text you you reply. Yeah, sure. As soon as possible. Yeah. Okay, so he's very friendly too. So, my girls, rush. Like, you, you can see he's so nice and then everything is on point. Yeah. So, who knows? Maybe I might text you too. Who knows? Yeah. So, yes. Thank you so much. Hello, pretty. I'm Susan Angie. I'm Kamara. Kamara. Oh, okay. I like that name, Kamara. Oh, it's a very nice thing. And then I like your African prints where your outfits and everything. Thank it's you. very nice. Yeah. Okay, so Kamara, I want to ask you a very simple question okay. okay so would you like to be in a distance relationship <laughs> hey y'all come look at this yes of course if i love the person so no matter where he is i'll i'll like we'll continue to be in the relationship yeah yeah okay, but are you single or you have to keep I'll, I'll prefer it to be uh, confidential. Yeah. Oh, okay. No problem. No problem. <laughs> okay, so why would you want to be in a distant relationship? Because, you see, when you love someone, as I said, no matter where the person is, so if you love the person, uh, like you can, how do we call it? You can still be in the relationship. So it depends on how the person will, like, you manage your distance relationship but so okay so are you sure the person is not going to cheat or do anything awkward behind you or something <sighs> if the person is not honest that means like it will it will be its own matter but as for me if i love you i'll still be waiting for you no matter how many long it will take and all those things oh, wow. wow that's my julie okay and how you know if this person is honest or not like you see for instance if you are with a person and then uh the first month that he is not with you that there is a distance like you'll be ch like you'll be chatting more times and all those things so but as soon as the person has started to uh, doing something doing something like you realize that there is something going on you will feel it yeah okay, so what if you don't feel it I think you will feel it. Oh. Oh, okay, so, so you think feel it. Oh, okay, so what if you don't? Okay, you said you think you feel it. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, so Kamara, yeah. people are watching you out there. Yeah, because your, your, your beauty is so, I mean, so, like, it's beyond the ordinary. Oh, okay. Yeah, so yeah. I would like you to leave your social media handle okay yeah right now i'm running to be miss francophone ghana miss francophone ghana please listen to it very very well miss francophone ghana mm -hmm. yes and then there is an ongoing vote on instagram and facebook okay. and the name of the page is miss dot francophone ghana okay. and i'm number five so guys go and vote for korotum kamara I'm from Mali. Okay. Yeah. Please, please, please. I'm begging you all. Try your best and then vote for Kamara. She's number five. Number five. Contestant number five, yes. right? Yeah. Trust me. They're going to vote for you. Oh, thank yeah. You. Thank you so much for your thank time. You. Too. Hi, gentlemen. Good evening. Hi. Good evening. I'm Susan and you. I'm Jeffrey. Jeffrey. Okay, Jeffrey. You're live on Daily News. Hi. Please say hi to our viewers. Hi, viewers. I'm Jeffrey. Okay. Welcome to Daily News Live. Yeah. Right. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, so I want to ask a very simple question. 
Okay, so the question is, would you want to be in a distance relationship? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to be in a distance relationship. Yeah. So, first of all, what do you consider to be a distance relationship? Mm, I consider so many things. One is your partner is not around you. It's not around where you are staying, your location. And you guys don't really see each other often. Yeah, so. Okay, so what if you guys, let's say, are cry here. Let's say you are here in the Gon, and then your partner is in, let's say, um, Medina. But then you don't really see each other. Would you refer that to as a distance relationship? Yeah, because since we don't really see each other, yeah. then I'll take it as if she's far, far somewhere than me. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I get it. But are you single or you're dating? I'm single at the moment. If you investigate this is very well. I don't want to believe this. Why? What? <laughs> nice boy like you. With nice haircuts, nice shadows and everything. Yeah. You want to tell me I said no, it's hard to believe. I'm single. Are you sure? Yeah. Watch the camera and then tell them you are single. <laughs> I'm single. <laughs> okay, so Okay, okay. So why don't you consider um, a distance relationship to be an interesting one? Oh, a relationship is more like you need someone that you can share your thoughts with, you can sometimes go out with if you are not happy. So if the person is not with you, that you can do all those things that I just mentioned, then... I cast. Yeah, uh, cast. <laughs> okay, I get you. Okay, so... um. Please, eh, right now, my viewers, they are, they are asking themselves, oh, this guy is nice, I would like to befriend this guy, but I don't know how to befriend him. So, to make everything simple for them, just give us your social media handle. It could be Snap, it could be IG, so they can, you know, okay. I hope you won't air them. Well, yeah. Okay, so. Okay. So, I'm on Instagram as Rich Boy Jeffrey, Snapchat, Rich Boy Jeffrey. All the social media, rich boy Jeff. Okay, so rich boy Jeffrey, um, passing the necklace alone. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so Jeffrey, thank you so much for your time. Right. Oh, pretty. I'm so sad you. I'm Nanama. Nanama. Oh, I like your name. No, I'm much interested in local names and all that. Okay, so Nanama, give them a 360 so they, you know, they see everything fully and your hair, everything. <laughs> okay, so Nanama, I want to ask a very simple question. Okay, so would you like to be in a distance relationship? Oh yeah, why not? Hey, Abigail! Full time? Really? <laughs> the first time was so nice, I had to do it twice. Nama, please look through the camera so that everybody will see your beauty. Like your, your... Oh, okay. Okay, so you want to be in a distance? Yeah. Why? Because I feel like being in a distance relationship kind of gives you guys some sort of um thing to hold on to it's not every time that you want to see each other depending on how i am i feel being around each other all the time like you just show up all the time it's very much unnecessary so being in a distant relationship yeah so your partner seeing every time you know reduces your importance or what like you know oh, yeah. you being available too much to your partner reduces your importance is that what I'm, i should say i'm saying looking at the kind of person i am i don't like you like being around all the time yes i uh, oh okay uh -huh. okay i get you but don't you think um this nice relationship can bring lots of problems and things in the relationship like maybe you you overthink and then be like maybe my guy is cheating on me blah 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 and all that it can that's why relationship comes with trust so if you are insecure i don't think you should go for it but i'm a very secure person so I don't mind being in a relationship. Oh, okay, okay. But Nana Ma, like to be honest, are you single or you're taken? Am I? Are you single? No, I'm not. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm not single. Okay, thank you so much for speaking the truth. Because people, most people are like, I'm, <clears throat> I'm single, I'm single, I'm single, and then I don't believe most of them. Yeah, but people out there want to be your friend and all that. So can you leave your social 
you go out there like him yeah they want to be your friend so can you leave your social media handle for us to know even me maybe i can text you up. so yeah okay so on instagram can follow me on keen underscore underscore love l-u-v k-e-e-n-l-u-v and then stop that too okay okay so my guys out there you have i hope you've heard the handle yeah and all that so, rush like rush rush and then text nanama else you'll be left behind yes yeah, so nanama thank you so much for your time oh gentlemen i'm susan and you my name is real tony what real tony real tony oh okay is it the name your parents give to you or you've added something little to it yeah, my name is Tony, but I'm real, so I'm real Tony. Oh, okay, I like that. Your shirt is very nice. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so real Tony, because yeah. I want to ask you a very simple question. Okay. Yeah, and then is um the question is, would you like to be in a distance relationship? Distance relationship. Yeah. I would say no. You say no. Okay, why would you say no? Um, because it wouldn't work for me. Um. For my personality, yeah. yeah, if I'm not in touch with the person, I easily forget yeah, about you. Yeah. Really? Okay, don't you think when you are in touch with the person and then you do something like so the person will get to know or you don't want that? I'm a very loyal person, so you can, yes. Hey. So, um, when we are in touch, Things will go on, right? Yeah, ever cost things will go on. I get it. I get it. But are you single or you have a girlfriend? I'm single. I don't believe this. So, or are you are you trying to deny your girlfriend or what? I'm not denying anyone. Yeah, single. Yes. Yeah. Are you sure? Like very, very sure you're single. Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, so you wouldn't want to be in a distance relationship? No. I would be interested to know what do you think? No, I, I like um I like to be with you. Yeah. Distance relationship would be something else. You you'd only have to talk on phone. You guess it's yes, it's it's not all that nice. It's not all that nice. Like oh. once we are talking face to face, you see it's nice. Yes, I can see you can see me. Yes. And you can do things to yeah. Add that part to it. <laughs> oh, that one there. Yeah. We not get there yet. So, yeah. Hey, how do you mean you, you've not gotten there yet? Oh, we, we are still young. Hey. Okay, maybe you wouldn't want to mention your age here, but I know you are not young. You are old enough to, you know, do things. Yes. But then, don't worry. Yeah. Don't worry. Thank you so much for your time. Hey, sorry, but before you leave, please, I want you to leave your social media handle. It could be IG, Snap, whatever. Yeah, for people to, you know, text because for all you know, people are willing to text you like, oh gosh, this guy is cute, this guy is nice. Yeah, so I would like you to leave your social media handle, any Snap or IG. Yeah. Okay, so I'm I'm on Twitter. Twitter. Okay. Yes, at real Tony one underscore. Yeah, and the same on Instagram. Yeah. Okay, so Real Tony one underscore. Yeah, so my girls, I hope you are listening. I hope you are taking notes. Okay, thank you so much for your time. I'm Susan and you. I'm Sheila. You are Sheila. Okay, so Sheila, you are live on Daily News Hype. Please say hi to our viewers. Hi, hello everyone. <laughs> yeah, okay, so Sheila, I want to ask you a very simple question. Okay, so are you in a relationship? <laughs> hey, y'all, come look at this. Um, no, 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 at the moment, no, I'm not. But you've been in a relationship before. Um, no. Hey, I'll be gay. Full time? Really? No. Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Okay, so what do you consider as a distance relationship? Um, distant relationship is when maybe you are in Ghana and your partner is abroad or somewhere far away not very close to you but when you guys are close maybe in, in the same country but different towns yeah that's not a distant relationship but maybe abroad and that's a distant relationship oh okay so the way you've explained it so well will you want to be in one um it depends when your partner is faithful that's fine hey. <laughs> i'm sure you can live without your partner for let me say five years 
and then you are you are here thinking maybe he's faithful or something. Are you sure that's going to work? Five years is too much, but <laughs> I mean maybe for like three months or something. But after that, you guys can you can visit each other. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's say maybe you are here. What's nice in maybe um northern region or maybe northern yeah, region. Yeah. Wow, <laughs> northern region. Nah. I, I wouldn't go into a distant relationship. Go into a distant rela- Is it because you have trust issues or what? Yeah, I do. I have. I have mm. trust. Yeah, I really. And do. are you an overthinker? I I think as right. Yeah, mm. I do. Yeah, I do. <laughs> okay, I think overthinking ruins relationship. Or well, what do you think? It does, but sometimes. Uh, Sometimes I think we the things we think about they are right. They are right. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Since you don't want to be in a distant relationship, I wouldn't go. I wouldn't say much. Okay. Yeah, but then all I have to say is that you're looking so good. Thank your hair, you. your dress, everything, your outfit, yeah, everything is on point. Thank but you. before you go, I would like you to you know leave your social media handle any could be Snap or Instagram so people can text you can be friends or oh, you don't want friends i do i do okay yeah so. you want to you have to you know, get the connections and all that so please let's have your social media handle amy okay so i'm on tiktok hey a tiktoker <laughs> yeah oh okay okay you. um my tiktok handle is um shesi s-h-e underscore s-i-8 shesi8 yeah i hope you are taking notes <laughs> and I'm on Instagram right. too. It's um Sheila Mankwa. Sheila yeah. Mankwa. Yeah. Okay. And okay, so Snap mm-hmm. Snap is um Deja Vu. Hey Deja Vu. Why? Are you a francophone? No, are you I'm from a French student? Oh, okay. So you want to show us your yeah. oh okay. I like that. <laughs> I like that. Okay, so Sheila. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. You're yeah. Oh pretty. I'm Susan Ng. I'm Theodora. Theodora. Okay, Theodora, I like your hair. Oh, thank you so much. Golden color and all that. Yeah, yeah, nice too. Thank you. Okay, Theodora, you're live on Daily News. Hi, please say hi to our viewers. Hello. <laughs> okay, so Theodora, I want to ask you a question. Uh-huh. A very simple one. Would you want to be in a distance relationship? No, I would not. Is it? Yes! Hey, Blair, whoa! Hey! Why? Um, I find myself to be someone who likes to, you know, spend quality time with my partner. So I would, I don't know, it would just be an inconvenience for me to not see you as often as I would like to. Right? And do you think that's going to spoil anything? You not seeing him for some time, I sure it's going I mean, to. Long distance means a really long period of time, and then when you do get to see him, it's going to be for a very short period of time. And it's not going to work for me. It's not going to work for you. I want to do the least things with you. Like, oh, you're running an errand. I want to just go with you. You know, things like that. Not not anything major. But then if I'm somewhere and then you are like 10,000 miles away, it's not going to be possible. The least I can afford is to talk to you on video call and things. And personally, it's insufficient. <laughs> okay, so what do you consider to be a distance relationship? For instance, I'm here. Yeah in Accra and my partner is maybe in the northern region. Okay. I mean my partner were even in like Ibri or you know Cape Coast somewhere it's maybe a two hour drive that's okay that's manageable but somewhere where you have to spend a really long time on the road or okay. even have to take a flight which will be quite expensive it makes everything just it's, it puts a strain <laughs> on the relationship in my opinion. Yeah I get you okay but are you single or okay. <laughs> the way you are talking about it and all that <laughs> To be very honest, I've never been in a relationship. I'm usually, I don't know. It's something I'm working on. Hey, wonderful. Shall never end. But you've never been in a relationship. Are you serious? Yeah. Really? Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. My people out there are, are surprised because a nice girl like you. Is it that you don't want it or you have decided not to go into it? Uh, yes, I have decided. It's like, not like I have decided not to go into it. I'm just a bit too careful. Oh, okay, so when the guys come, you keep bouncing them like that. Keep... Sort of. Sort of. Oh, but oh. I'm working on it. I'm working on it. You're working on it. Yeah. Oh, okay. I hope you get a guy who wouldn't be far away from you, Wait. like you wish. Yeah. Okay, so Theodora, please, eh, my people there, out there are watching. They'll be like, come on, this girl is cute. Her hair and all that. Her glasses alone. Yeah, we want to, you know, be friends with her. Mm. Yes, yeah, so please, I want you to, you know, leave your social media handle 
yeah so they follow up and then text you i hope you won't bounce them especially with the guys i hope you won't bounce them i can't make any promises oh okay you can't make any promise but i hope when they text you in a friendly way you're going to respond oh yes i would okay. i think when it comes to them i do a good job you do a good job <laughs> okay <my> best too. <laughs> oh okay that's nice okay so Thera, please give us your any handle i mean any social media it could be ig snap or whatever yeah um i don't know snap ig yeah. okay my instagram is yara oklu y-a-y-r-a-o-k-l-u together are you an ewe yes i am oh wow <laughs> oh, i guess i'm pretty <laughs> come on <laughs> okay so yeah you're at right okay just that right yes, sir. okay thank you so much for your time thank you too. once again i love your hair i really really love your hair thank, thank you for you your know. time guys we've come to the end of this video i hope you liked it yeah i'm sure i'm so so sure you like this video yeah but please guys don't forget to vote for kamara yeah she's the contestant number five let's all help one another yeah and then please don't forget to subscribe to this channel like the video and then share it as well leave a comment at the comment section too once again the name is susan thank you so much for your time
Ghana. Yes. Okay, so Hunter Wine yes. Girls is the best in Ghana. Okay, so please, um, why are you saying it's the best? From um, because the best comes from the west, yeah, and we have certain facilities. And we, you see, the place is strong. I mean, Antaman Girls is really a nice school that you would love to be. Oh, okay, you break down there, people. good evening, guys. Welcome back to Street Vibes on Daily News Hive. Yes, Susan is still the name, don't forget. Please also don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and share it as well. Yeah, and then today we are going to know which school or let's say which SHS is the best in Ghana here. Yes, yeah, so let's go out there and pick the views of our lovely people. Yes, relax and enjoy this content. Thank you so much. Good evening, gentlemen. I'm Susan and you. My name is Prince. <laughs> oh, okay, Prince. Um, yeah, live on Daily News. Hi, please say hi to our viewers. Hi, 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 everyone. Hi, everyone. Thank you. Okay, so which SHS is the best in Ghana? Um, if you have to ask this question, I don't think you get um a general answer. You understand? What, bro? What are you talking about, man? Because, um. If you are to ask everyone which SHS school is the best, you or she is going to say the school that the person attended is the best school. Okay. Because of one or two features that the person has seen in the school. You understand? Yeah. yeah. So, um, I attended Achimota Motown, so I will say my school is the best. Uh, wait, 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 what is that? I will say my school is the best. Hey, hey, hey. Yes, of course. Yeah. Hey, Motown. So, okay. So, I think it's because you attended the school. That's why I oh, say the school is the not, best. Yeah. Not because you see, as I said earlier, yeah. But then not because <laughs> I attended the school. That's what I'm saying. It's the best school. That's not because you know all the prominent people like yeah, they were attending the school, and then the school is still progressing and all that with good results and everything. So there's not two ways about it. Okay, so I want you to give me one solid reason why you are saying the school is the best. Or I is it that you people are riding in past glories or like I want to know why are you saying it's the best? Um you want to one hundred reason. Yeah, just, just one solid reason. Oh, okay, okay, okay. So um um it's just it's too much <laughs> You know uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Um like it's punch, it's punch. I don't know. It's punch. Okay, so just mention a few. Okay, so the um, academic performance. Yeah, and then the inf infrastructure in the school too. Okay, yeah. So yeah, that's it. So the infrastructure, the yeah, academic performance, the discipline in the school and order. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so you are saying the academic performance, infrastructures and what? Discipline. Discipline. Oh, okay. So, to him, he's saying um, Motown is the best SHS in Ghana. Okay, let's let's, let's um, go in for others' views and see what they have for us. Thank you so much for your time. Hello, young ladies. I'm Susan Ndi. I'm Sapoma. Sapoma Ndi. I'm Jenny. Jenny. Oh, okay. You have very nice names and then pretty faces as well. Yeah, so please, you're live on Daily News. Hi, please say hi to our viewers. Hi. Hi. Okay, so hi, hi, hi. Yeah. Okay, so which SHS is the best in Ghana? It's about to go best. Probably I'll say my school. I went to Antamine Girls from the Western region. Okay, so your school, right? Okay. I also say same because I went to the same SHS. I said, a handsome girl is the best in Ghana. Wow. wow. That's my Juliet. Nah. Yes. <laughs> okay, so a handsome girl yes. is the best in Ghana. Okay, so please, um, why are you saying it's the best? From, um, because the best comes from the west, yeah, and we have certain facilities. And we, you see, the place is strong. I mean, Antaman Girls is really a nice school that you would love to be. Oh, okay, like, my school, is, we have um, um, yeah, but Ghana's most beautiful 2016 for my school, so you should actually know it. <laughs> Oh, okay, please. Okay, to add up to it, you see, I think we are the best in the West, and the, the best always comes from the West. And then we have Yaba, as she said, Yaba comes from our place, the same school she completed our school, and then she contested for the Ghana's, Ghana's was beautiful, and she won. So it's actually true that the best really comes from the West, and then there is light on the hill, which is our anthem as well. So I will choose my 
my school of yeah. our all schools. This current um, GMB, we have one contestant from our school. Yes. Really, my yes. year from the yeah. Yeah. Oh, so please vote for her. <laughs> okay, now you vote, you vote, you vote. It's like you girls are so proud of your school. I like that. Yes. Yeah, we are very yes. proud of my school. I like that. We're there. We don't like that school. <laughs> okay, so when you're there, you didn't like it, but then now you are proud of Oh, like, I like it. That's a very good sign. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Bye. Hello, good evening. I'm Susan NG. Uh, good evening, madam. My name is Godfrey. Godfrey, okay. Please, you're live on Daily News. Hi, please say hi to our viewers. You see, I can hear you. Okay, I'm saying you're live on Daily News. Hi, okay. yeah, so please say hi to our viewers. <laughs> Just say hi to our viewers. Uh, okay, okay. Okay, so um, which SHS is the best in Ghana here? Yeah. <coughs> KTI. KTI. Yeah. Please, what's the full name? You see? The full name. Sorry. KTI. KTI. Okay, so please, the full. Oh, okay, Kumasi Technical Institution. Institution. Oh, okay, okay. Um, please, why is um why are you saying it's the best? Oh, yeah, environment and and uh, okay. <laughs> uh, I want pressure, pressure. <laughs> you see, you're miserable, as my dear. When I wanted you to go to school. You were busy climbing all the mango trees along the school roads. So that's... <laughs> <laughs> so the environment, just the environment. Oh, environment and uh, story buildings and uh, games and... and uh... <laughs> Fish. Look, enough is enough. Have you heard me? Enough is enough. Like, yeah, in other things, in mini war. Okay, okay, so I can see your school be very interesting. Oh, that wasn't where you attended. Yeah. That was that where you attended the SHS? Oh, okay, I can see the school be very interesting because the way you're talking about the games, the story buildings and all that. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you so much for your time. Okay. Hello, good evening. I'm Susan and you. Jenna. Okay, Jenna, you're live on Daily News Live. Please say hi to our viewers. Hi. Okay, so which SHS is the best in Ghana here? <laughs> um... Okay, I think uh, Wesley Girls. Wesley Girls. Okay, so why do you think it's Wesley Girls? Because we have other schools, and why are you choosing Wesley Girls? Okay, so um, they are good academically, and then the way they dress, the way their buildings are. Yeah. So just the way they dress, the way they are. Oh, just that. Yes, and then academically good too, so I think it's the best. Yeah, academically good too. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, which SHS did you attend? Acarusly Girls. Acarusly Girls, so just like, yo. Oh, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. I think that's why you're choosing that school, exactly. yes. And then it's a fact, it's true, like, it's true. I say it's true. Okay, thank you so much for your time. Okay. And I'm Susan NG. I'm please, I'm, I'm Daniel, or you can call me one side. One side. Yeah. I think I love one side and yeah. Daniel. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, please, you're live on Daily News. Hi. So please say hi to our viewers. Hi, US. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So which SHS is the best in Ghana here? Hey, y'all, come look at this. Yeah. Mm. Uh, UAS. Not UAS. UAS. U E S S. That's a uh, Confanochi Senior High School. Okay. There's no doubt of saying Confanochi is the best senior high school in Ghana. What? Yeah. Oh, okay, so please, why are you saying is the best SHS in Ghana here? Mm, I think um, 2015 we have records there. We were the, um, we were ranked second in Ashanti region. And then go sit down. Okay. See, yeah, and uh, anytime we meet um schools like um Prempe and uh, um KTI, KTI, yeah, per se. Katie, we beat them in any games. We meet them. We meet. We beat them. So really, oh okay. So just that. Oh, uh, not only that, um, but our environment and like I think um, our school uniform. Oh, 
Hey, if you see our uniform, eh, you cry for us. Sir? Yeah, Violet and Yellow. And even the names, the name per se, or Confanochi, is not a small name. It's a very great name. So is that true? No. So is that true? I said no. Ah. Hey, what a surprise. Yeah, with a lot of achievements too. Yeah, oh, okay. So you are saying Okonfanochi Senior High School is the best SHS in Ghana. But please, was that where you attended SHS? Yeah, I attended SHS at Okonfanochi Senior High School in 2020. Oh, okay. Thank you so much for your time. Eh? Good evening, gentlemen. I'm Susan NG. Good evening. I'm Emmanuel. You can call me Kobe 7. Kobe 7. Oh, okay. So, Kobe 7, please, you are live on Daily News High. Please say hi to our viewers. Okay, hi. Okay, so which SHS is the best in Ghana? Oh, to me, the Convanochi. Convanochi. Okay. Oh, okay. So why are you saying it's a Convanochi? Oh, okay. I think they um, like on my environment they come uh, like uh, those of games, you no know, manage homes, I you know. And that's the reason why they manage home. Okay, the environment, the games, and the academics, and Kahana. Oh, Ningi and Kahundi, a baby, many general parents in our mammy. Hey, Kobe Bini Kobe Bini. Oh, okay, okay. Patrona Hona Coast Guana. Oh, and you want to be a cool school, but many gym. And you want to school, but we need gym because of our more academic performance environment in the games. Nad, nad. Oh, okay, Matia, see, I'm a dancing baby. Please, thank you so much for your time. Hello, guys, we've come to the end of this video. I will need you all to kindly subscribe to this channel like the video and share it as well please don't forget to um leave a comment in the comment section also yeah thank you so much for your time
Okay, so the question is, let's say you are given the chance to send a message to your ex. What kind of message will you send to him? Oh, I wish him all the best and everything that he does may be prosperous here. Hey, Abigail! Phone time! Really? <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to Street Vibes on Daily News Hive. The name is Susan. Yes, and today is all about me going about asking people the kind of messages they will send to their exes if they are given the chance to send them messages. Yes, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the videos, comment, and then share it as well. Yes, please sit back and enjoy our interesting content. Thank you so much. Good afternoon, Pretty. I'm Susan and you. I'm Mabel. Mabel, wow, a very nice name. Please, I want to ask a very simple question. So the question is, when you are given the chance to send a message to your ex, what will you tell him? <laughs> hey, y'all, come look at this. Yeah. Hey. Ex, who are you, dear? Thank you so much for your time. <laughs> I have one beautiful lady here with me. Hello, I'm Susan and you. I'm Nali. Nali, hey, a very nice name. Okay, so you are live on Daily News Hi. You can say hi to our viewers. Hi. Okay. Um, my question is, let's say you are given the chance to send a message to your ex. What particular thing or what message will you send to him? Oh, nothing much. I just wish him the best in life. That's all. Hey, wonderful. Shall never end. <laughs> The best in life. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Thank you so much. But please don't forget to subscribe, like, share the video, and then, yeah, thank you so much for your time. One young and then pretty lady here with me. Hello, I'm Susan and you. I'm Mango. Mango, Mango, Mango. Okay, I have a very simple question for you today. Okay, so the question is the question is when you're giving the chance to send a message to your ex, what will you tell him? A message to my ex. Exactly. Uh, well, I don't wish him bad though, but he should. He should what? <laughs> he, should. <laughs> he should. He should keep on with whatever he's doing. Yeah, hey. ah! You got him. Oh. If we investigate this, we better one. Okay. Being it positive or negative, right? Um, I don't hate anyone, so I can't hate my ex. Okay, so if it's negative, you advise him so on jai. Negative. Yeah. Like how? Like what? Okay, let's say maybe. Okay, well, negative as in negative. Like maybe he's living a rascal life. Exactly. Uh, I'll advise him to stop okay. or, and do things that will impact his life positively. But if it's negative, mm, Charlie, he should go to hell. Is it? He should go to hell. Hey, whoa! Hey! Hey, okay, thank you so much for your time. But then don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like the video, share it, and then comment at the comment section. Thank you so much for your time. <laughs> Hello, pretty. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Yeah. I'm Susan and you. Mary Kay. Mary Kay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for your time. Yes. I want to ask you a very simple question. Please, you can say hi to our viewers before. Hi. Hello. Yeah. Okay. So the question is. Let's say you are given the chance to send a message to your ex. What kind of message will you send to him? Oh, I wish him all the best. And everything that he does may be prosperous here. Hey, Abigail. Phone time? Really? Oh, okay, okay, okay. You wish him all the best. Oh, okay. That's very fine. It's like you have a very good heart. Oh, yeah. As your mom is. Okay. okay, that's very great. Thank you so much for your time. But then please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, share it, and comment as well. Thank you so much. I have one nice gentleman here with me today. Please, I'm Susan and you. Francis. Francis, okay. Please, you're live on Daily News Hive. You can say hi to our viewers. Hi, guys. Yeah. Please, I want to ask a very simple question. Sure. So, my question is let's say you are given the chance to send a message to your ex. What message will you send to her? Well, my message will be that my ex had an impact in my life, right? Whatever happened, happened. It wasn't us to control it, but it happened. So I would just wish her the best of happiness. And yeah, she actually taught me something. So I'll use what I learned to 
make a good impact in my new relationship. You see all this Igbo when people they smoke for empty belly? <laughs> and the result be that. You are dreaming! <laughs> hey! <laughs> but that doesn't mean I should wish her bad no matter what she did. Yeah. But it depends though, for some people. But then, for me, she did, she did, she did teach me something. So I wish her happiness and whatever she do, she should do. Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, you have a very interesting answer. Thank you so much for your time. But please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and share it as well. Thank you so much for your time. I have one handsome gentleman here with me. Hello, I'm Susan and you. I'm Sam. Sam, okay. Um, we are live on Daily News Hive and you can say a very big hi to our viewers. Hi. Please, I want to ask a very simple question. So, let's say you are giving the chance to send a text message to your ex. What exactly would you tell her? Um, I mean, we didn't, we didn't leave um, on of... Uh, bad notes so I mean I always say the best of luck and then yeah okay. <laughs> that's basically it Oh, okay, so you wish her the best of luck. Oh, okay, okay. Thank you so much for your time. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like the video, share it as well. Thank you. Guys, we've come to the end of this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like the video, share it, and then leave a comment at the comment section as well. Thank you all for your time. Please, I'm Susan Andy. Hi, I'm Sandra. Sandra, oh, okay. Okay, so Sandra, please, you're live on Daily News Hive, so please say hi to our viewers. Hi. <laughs> okay, so Sandra, please, will you date somebody who is 20 years older than you? 20 years. Yes, please. No. Yes, you. No. Please, why are you saying no? That's that's too much. That's too much. 20 years, yeah. Nah, I can't date someone who is way older than my brother. Good evening guys, welcome back to Street Vibes on Daily News Hive. Yes, yeah, Susan is still the name. Before I proceed, please and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like the video and share it as well. And also please don't forget to leave a comment at the comment section too. Yeah, so today is all about me asking people, both boys and girls, um, if they would um, date people who are 20 years older than them, being it a girl or a boy. Yeah, so let's go for our answers from people and then see what they have for us. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you, <laughs> thank you so much. Good evening, fine one. I'm Susan and you. I'm Patrick. Patrick, okay. So, Patrick, please, you're live on Daily News. Hi, please say hi to our viewers. Hi. Yes, hi. Okay, so will you date somebody who is 20 years older than you? 20 years older than me. Yes, please. Is a no for me. Okay. I know. Why I know? Um, someone who is 20 years older than me. You see, as a man, you need to establish yourself first before you go into marriage, you know. And then nowadays the ladies or the women who are out there looking for husband they want someone who can take care of them you see the thing so as a man you need to establish yourself get something like for the family so that you won't suffer when you get into marriage that's the reason why i won't date somebody 20 years older than me because before then she might at least, you see, she's older than me, and then I won't be comfortable with it. I need somebody who I am older than, so that at least we can do some kind of chemistry combination and then stuff. You see, that's it. <laughs> <laughs> Silly boy. Uh, okay, yeah. so if I get you clearly, yeah, I tried to say that you want somebody you are older than. Yes. Yeah, sure. So you'll be able to, you know, like. Yeah, move with the person. Move with the person. You see, if. You are older than a person now. There can there will be some kind of respect, you know.
But here comes the case the woman is older than you. If you're talking to the person, at least for me, I need to show some respect to her because she's older than me. But in the case where I'm older than the person, at least I'll earn some respect for my wife. And I think I'm okay with that one instead of the wife being older than me. Okay, but I'm sure you know some women can be very submissive. Even if she's older than you, she can be very submissive to you. Oh yeah, that is true. Some, that's the point. Some, not all. And in our recent and modern life right now, women who are submissive, in fact, it's very, very less. It's scarce to get such women. And maybe may the woman to be working in a company where he earns more than you. And then you need she need to be submissive to you as a husband again. You see that thing? Yeah. It's very, very scary. So okay. for me, it's a no for me. I won't go for a woman who is older than me 20 years. No. Okay. Thank you so much, Patrick. Yeah. Thank you so much for your time. Hello. I'm Susan Andrew. I'm Abigail. Okay. Abigail. Abigail, please. You're live on Daily News Hive. Say hi to our viewers. Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. Okay. So please, um, will you date somebody who is 20 years older than you? 20 years. Yes, please. I'm not sure about that. You say? I'm not sure about that. Hey! I'm not sure about that. Okay, please, what are your reasons? 20 years is like a lot. <laughs> That's how I see it. I don't know. Marriage, right? Like dates. Dates. Still, I want. You want. But for marriage, will you? It depends. It depends. It depends on what? A lot. It depends on a lot. Regina Daniels is there and she's fine, right? Yeah, she's fine. So it depends. Maybe I'll have her reasons. Okay, so don't you think um, you dating somebody who is 20 years older than you, probably a guy, don't you think he'll be so bossy over everything and even over, over you? Um, no, I don't think so. If it comes to love, I don't think people act that way. Somebody can be like older than somebody like 10 or 6, but they are okay. He'll give you your views, like, he'll give you the respect when it's necessary. So I don't think. Okay, so he will give you the respect when it's necessary. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Thank you so much for your good evening. Please, I'm Susan and you. I'm Edmund. Edmund. Okay, so Edmund, please, you're live on Daily News. Hi, please say hi to our viewers. Hello. Hello. Okay, so please, will you date somebody who is 20 years older than you? Uh, I wouldn't try doing that because the person might be my mother. Jesus! I want to go home. I don't want to. <laughs> 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 your mother <laughs> yeah. very very true how can i date someone who is 20 years older than me and uh, would you also date someone who is 20 years older than you mm, that is a question <laughs> yeah. okay so what you wouldn't do i was I, I would not also do that's the main fact and i'm also a christian too Hey, okay, so dating somebody who is 20 years older than you, does it mean you are not a Christian or what? I'm not saying you're not a Christian. I know my Christian values. So I'm not likely, even for you to, for me to even date my mates, it means that it should end up in marriage, not for this secular life. Just me dating you to have fun. No, it should some. It should be something that is going to what lead into marriage. That's when you, I can say that I can date somebody. That's all I have to say. Oh, okay. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. Thank, to, you <laughs> thank you too for your time. <laughs> Please, I'm Susan Andy. Hi, I'm Sandra. Sandra, oh, okay. Okay, so Sandra, please, you're live on Daily News Hive. So please say hi to our viewers. Hi. <laughs> okay, so Sandra, please, will you date somebody who is 20 years older than you? 20 years. Yes, please. No. Yes, you. No. Please, why are you saying no? That's that's too much. That's too much. 20 years, dear. Nah. I can't date someone who is way older than my brother. Die, 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 die. 
<laughs> way older than your brother. But what if the person is rich? Oh no 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 no. You don't want. They are young guys, uh, maybe five years older than I am, and then are rich. So. Oh okay. So you wouldn't go in for somebody who is twenty years older than you. Oh okay. Okay. Thank you so much for your time. Good evening, gentlemen. Please, I'm Susan and you. I'm Samuel. Okay, Samuel, please say hi to our viewers. You are live on Daily News Hive. Okay. Please, will you date somebody who is 20 years older than you? 20? Yes, please. <laughs> well, I guess it depends. You don't get work, Abby? 70 years old, man. Hey, wonderful. Shall never end. <laughs> um, please, it depends on what? I get to know the person and it's cool. If you get to know the person at the school, you go ahead dating the person or uh, yeah. Twenty years so Okay. <laughs> you see no um like anything bad with it or you see it's cool, right? I don't really see the damage it will cause if we are both consenting. Full time? Really? <laughs> the first time was so nice, I had to do it twice. Uh, Jesu! Okay, okay. I get you. Okay. So, meaning in all, you'll be comfortable, right? <laughs> yeah. Meaning you'll be comfortable with everything. Not comf... It's difficult because, honestly, people would see you from the outside and complain, say, and the age gap between you and things. But I guess if the both of you are okay with it, then it's fine. Okay, so are you sure the girl or the lady won't tend to, dis to be disrespectful or anything? Oh, like I said, you have to get to know them first, but there's also a chance that people can hide their attitude and before the whole thing. But, like I said, it depends on the situation. You get it? Okay. If you don't get it, forget about it. All right. It depends on the situation. Okay, I get you clearly. Thank you so much for your time. I'm Susan and you. I'm Mabel. Mabel. Okay, you have a very nice name. Thank you. Okay, so please, Mabel, you are live on Daily News Hive. Please say hi to our viewers. Hi, everybody. <laughs> hi. Okay, so will you date somebody who's 20 years older than you? No. Hey, whoa! Hey! Why? Because the person is... Okay, the, considering the age gap is too vast because let's say I will be 25 and then, then the person will be let's say 45 like that's too much and then even if you give birth like how old did your children be before the man will reach a retirement age or the man will reach the age of him get or started dying or something like that <laughs> so i wouldn't be um very happy marrying someone that is 20 years older than me okay, okay i get it i get it so that's your reason uh, maybe the person will blah 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 you up. oh okay you have a very good answer and then yeah so thank you so much for your time i like your hair you. hello gentlemen good evening good evening i'm susan and you i'm richard richard okay richard please you are live on daily news hi please say hi to our viewers hi hi to everyone watching daily news hi hi yes please <laughs> okay so please will you date somebody who is 20 years older than you i'm not sure i can do that 20 years is too much. what Much. It's too much. Okay, why are you saying that? Uh, I mean, so we normally know women age really faster, and having 20 years, yo, I can't. I mean, the age alone is an issue for me, and psychologically, I can't, I can't take that. I can't, you can't take, take that. that. Okay, so is it that she will die early or what? Oh, it's not about even death. It's about, I mean, at this age, I'm not even ready now, and then, so at what age am I going to get someone 20 years? I mean, child death. It's going to be a whole lot, but it's 20 she might have even passed a monopause and all, so I just can't take that. Yeah, <laughs> okay, so your answer is you just can't take that. There are nicer girls around, so who are younger. <laughs> so. can, there can be a 20 year somebody who is 20 years older than you, but then it's very nice, you know that. Absolutely, so there's an, an exception, right? So I, I wouldn't want to try that exception. Let's go with the, the normal vibe. <laughs> So let's go with a normal vibe. Okay, so Richard, thank you so much. I'm grateful. My lovely viewers, we've come to the end of this video. Yeah, I hope you liked it. If you really did, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel, like the video, and share it as well. And also, please don't forget to leave a comment at the comment section too. Thank you so much. Another time. Bye bye.